And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Winter Ezreal. This is going to be an Ezreal Frostbite deck. Uh, we're using the Frostbite spells to be leveling up Ezreal and pairing Ezreal with Ash. Of course, Ash is the Frostbite champion. These two also, the other thing that we're going to use for those two to be able to finish out games is Feel the Rush. Uh, really powerful 12 mana for all your card. Um, so we're going to uh, <laughs> have both those champions feel the rush to be able to bring them out, uh, bring them out, bring them out, and then we will, uh, yeah, win the game with them, basically. So it should be pretty easy to level up Ez Ezreal. Only takes the six targets. So it should be pretty easy leveling that up. And um, yeah, like this, this, this deck should do pretty well. Like I, I like the, the Rhyme Tusk Shaman in here, Frostbiting the Strongest Enemy every turn. Um, we have Shatter for, for some extra removal, right? Because we're going to be Frostbiting all sorts of stuff. So Shatter, a lot of times, we're going to be able to use this as like a two-mana deal four, so we can be able to kill champions that we need to kill with that. Then we also have Mystic Shot. We have Aftershock in here to destroy landmarks and be able to also kill champions as necessary. Rhyme Fang Wolf doing some challengers. Uh, and that's, a, that's about it. That's going to be our deck. It's going to be a lot of fun. Here we go. Winter, Ezreal, ooh, heading on over to the Freljord. <laughs> oh, hey, Harvey. Harvey's right here, I don't know if you can see Harvey. Yeah, you can kind of see her, just a little bit. There she is, right there. See, there's there's Harvey. She's my other dog, so that's, that's Harvey, and that's Puppy back there. Those are my two dogs. Uh, let's see, Lucian Hecarim again. All right, so Aftershock, good. And let's Mulligan Static Shock. But we definitely need to we need to be able to destroy Landmark. And then I like the Rhyme Thing Wolf Brittle Steel combo. I was thinking they probably wouldn't have too many one health things for Static Shock, but I guess Bark Beast is right up there. Wednesday nights, yeah, like this is our night stream. Um, uh... But, like, usually, like, this is, like, the dogs have, like, already eat, eaten dinner by now or, like, or so. Like, it's it's 6, 16 local time, and I usually feed them, be like, or between 5, 30 and 6. So Harvey's up here. He's like, where's my food? All right, big time. Got to kill that Aftershock right away because they could even have Haunted Relic. Haunted Relic. Or Onslaught of Shadows. That was a really nice Mystic Shot draw. Let's take out that thing. Alright, and Onslaught of Shadows is basically two mana Decimate. Alright, I'm going to pass the turn. I'm not going to just lead with the Rhyme Fang Wolf. Oh, but then we have Ash also. I'm going to pass the turn, though. So I want them to like play something. Iron Harbinger. Well, I'll just play this then. I can't brittle steel an iron harbinger. But if they play like Lucian, I would want to like Rhyme Fang Wolf, Brittle Steel, Lucian. No, another landmark. Oh no. What a top deck. All right, I guess I pass and try to keep Brittle Steel to protect Ash. Yeah, that's... That was a great top deck for them. Yeah, and now this is... Yeah, that, that's pretty great. Okay, well... Okay, well, I can let Ash go to one health. I can save Brittle Steel, but I'm... Taking a lot of damage there. Let's get Rhyme Tusk Shaman in play. Winter is the Freljord's true ruler. Ice runs in our veins. We are ready always. Show me a target. That, 
other plaza is pretty rough. Push back the darkness. Let's see, brittle steel would be four out of five. So then beginning a turn. So then basically, if I if I do brittle steel shatter right now, then I, I have a, a harsh winds to help protect. I probably need to kill the Lucian. That's probably what I just gotta do. Cause I guess yeah, because like this is gonna be frostbite at the beginning of the turn. Yeah, we gotta kill Lucian. I don't have a good emo. Why doesn't Ash have a cool emo? Like are we are we drawing? I guess maybe maybe because that's a round start, that's before we draw, so maybe we actually draw the uh whatever it's called. The crystal arrow. Yeah, we do. We draw the crystal arrow. Okay, that's kind of cool. So I can have Crystal Arrow plus Flash Freeze. Um. I don't know, that's not really a great Crystal Arrow, honestly. I think I'd rather Harsh Winds right now. Okay. Cause I wanted to see like if they if they'd spend like the two mana like haunted relic or something like that. All right, they're down to just one card. Ice runs in our veins. Yeah, probably. Still looking good. Come, the journey ahead is long. Both of our champions are leveled up, but I would rather, you know, I want to play like these kind of cards first. Winter, take you. We go, we go, we go. Mm. Those are going to be four fours. Probably a bad challenge, right? They just have like these three all challenge different things and then try to do seven damage to me. Can't touch this. <laughs> it's a good fizz, fizz emote. Good fizz emote. I don't know which way to go. I guess I get 10-10s. Ten ten it's like, how, how do we want to win? Do we want to play Ash and Ezreal, or do we want to play Feel the Rush? So the Feel the Rush is just one card in case that they would suddenly Ruination for some really weird reason. Now begins a new era of peace. And the same matchup. This deck's really popular right now. Um, after shock. After shock. We need aftershock to start with. Um, but very, very impressive how that first game went. Everything lined up pretty well for us. The Frostbite cards were awesome. There's 
a kill in the air. Unfortunately, no aftershock so far. I tried my I tried my best. I mulliganed all my cards. Aftershock? No. That's too bad. Let's just pass. See what they do. Don't get in my way. Another Lucian. Okay, I want to kill Lucian. Which means I'm gonna draw two. I gotta trade Mystic Shot for two cards. Yeah. Especially because Mystic Shot's really just kind of the best against Lucian, and they're not gonna really have Lucian's left. That's two Lucian's gone. They'll still have some Lucians left. Nothing escapes my watch. This is mercy. All right, that's good, brittle steel. I think I want to save the archer. Yeah, I want to save archer. Hmm. That's too bad. I, I had the flash freeze against frost against uh, um, sharp sight, but again against Hecarim, I would rather not use the flash freeze quite yet anyway. So I'm down to seven. We've killed a lot of good stuff. They still do have four cards. We've killed three Lucians and a Hecarim. And we're about to get rid of this loyal Badger Bear. Beginning a turn. Because Icefield Archer is definitely good against Ephemerals. Right? Like, that's their plan is, like, play Ephemerals. They've drawn four champions <laughs> so far. We've had zero. Oh, Iron Harbinger. You are annoying. Ice runs in our veins. Yep, I had to say something. Now we got a champion. A true Falyorian will come. Don't ha I really hope they don't have another Hecarim. <laughs> I already killed two Hecarims and, and three Lucians. I really hope that they don't have the third Hecarim also, that they can go wide like that again. Because Hecarim's good against the Crystal Arrow. The frost reveals all to me. Show me a target. That's 15 damage. That doesn't kill them. 
So I might as well... Might as well save three damage and just get this thing out of here. Because, you know, we put them down to five, but Aftershock doesn't... Come, the journey ahead is, long. is that thing worth Aftershocking? Maybe if I would have just, like, cast Aftershock on them first. They play this. I, I go Crystal Arrow. They play something else. And then, like, if I would have drawn another unit that I could attack with. Two cards in hand, huh? Ice runs in our veins. Be three threes. We got that. Okay, let's see. So you block you. You block you. And you. No backing down. Just troll chant. You can't save. I can't save. Yeah, I can't save like both Rampant. Yeah, like we're gonna have to have one Rampant Wolf die, kind of no matter what I do. The frost reveals. All right, Frostbite beginning a turn. Attack Frostbite. Lethal. Lethal. Wow, alright, 2 0. Oh. Pretty impressive. That deck is really good, and yeah, so being that deck twice, pretty impressive. <laughs> well, there's only one deck being played right now. I guess it's Lucian Hecarim. Okay, we. Yeah, just got to mulligan it all. We just got to find Aftershock. We didn't find Aftershock at all last game, but my opponent didn't have Plaza. So we were lucky. It, it's really, really tough to beat the exact same deck three times in a row. Please no Plaza. Please no Plaza. It's something else. No, they have Plaza. GG's. GG's. Yes. Okay, we have a chance. Game's not over. That's so satisfying. That crumbling of the landmark. So satisfying. Yeah, yeah, I'm, up. Um, I'm just, just gonna pass. For now. All right, let's mess some folks up. A chill in the air. Time to get rowdy. Hmm. Take three. I could use the, that five mana card. Uh, 
haven't seen Vile Feast before in these decks. Rhyme Tusk Shaman. Yeah, we could use a Rhyme Tusk Shaman. I guess the Vile Feast gets you another challenger, I guess. I'm not too enthusiastic about my chances against Triple Grizzled Ranger still, though, with just, you know, these one-for-one -one cards. Um, yeah, I'm not too... I'm not holding out hope here. Um, feel the rush. Maybe our best draw now. And these glimpse beyonds also just being more two for ones. And then, and then they find a plaza. GGs. <laughs> yeah, so it's really difficult to beat the same deck three times in a row, and yeah, we didn't. We drew the one Aftershock. That was a perfect draw. But besides that, you know, like, no champions ever. No Rhyme Test Shaman, no Feel the Rush. Uh, we, we drew one Static Shock. The question was, have we drawn anything over three mana? We drew a Static Shock. Noxus and PNZ? What is this? That doesn't play the Grand Plaza. How are they... What are they supposed to do? They don't have the Grand Plaza. How could they win? So this is a little weird. Like, Icefield Archer just dies to their stuff super easily. But maybe I shouldn't mulligan it. I don't know. I don't know about this Icefield Archer. I'll go ahead and mulligan it. <laughs> no, True Shot Barrage would not have helped whatsoever last game. I want my Rhymefang Wolf to do something more than get Mystic Shotted. Um, Feel the Rush, though, is probably going to be just a really important card, right? It makes the 10 10s. So, like, that's actually probably the card that I want to draw more than any other. So, like, when I'm mulliganing into other stuff, we want to see that card. I can't protect Ramping Wolf, though, so I, I think I'm going to just try it. Keep the Aftershock for the champions. And if this goes awry, I have Shatter for the Dredger. Whoa, all right, cool. It did not go awry. No Mystic Shot. That's pretty awesome. Don't blink or you miss me. Nope, don't miss you at all. Bye-bye. No way! All the world on one arrow. Cordic, what have you what have you been playing that you've been dominating the plaza deck?
Yeah, your own plaza deck. So Noxus, so you've been playing Noxus Plaza and beating Shadow Isles Plaza with, with the Noxus Plaza deck. Feel the rush. Almost. I have the best job. A true Fragorian welcome. This can just happen though with the frostbite decks. This is this can be the problem with frostbite decks. If you play against like a removal heavy deck, you know, like you like these frostbite cards can just get stuck in hand. Um, which is why we're playing one progress day. But honestly, maybe it should be like two progress days because like these kind of things can just happen. And, and this kind of happened like the the last game for us too. It's just if you play against an opponent that kills your stuff. Yeah, that card's good. Time for a true display of skill. They don't know what they're up against. Obstacle, meet gauntlet. We just want it. We have the three top end cards that we really want to draw. Two feel the rush, one progress day. Sounds dangerous. I'm in. I guess that was a bad block. No way. It's too bad we couldn't find any of those. in hand can't imagine this this works out well but you never know maybe a field of rush both of our champions are leveled up we could do 20 damage with a field of rush Using this means that now we will be able to brittle steel because we blocked earlier with the Ezreal. I got ways to find me mushrooms. Ha. No. Not the best time for progress day anymore with us having all the puff caps now. Oh, I guess we don't have as many puff caps as I thought. I guess they they got rid of some puff caps, but
There's Feel the Rush. Found it. Lead us to victory. Faster than my arrow? I think not. GG's. Because they're probably playing, what, two Captain Farons? I have two Field of Rush. In this game was they drew Captain Farron, I didn't draw Field of Rush, right? Like, if it was just the exact opposite, if I would have drawn Field of Rush and they did not draw Captain Farron, I think that we win this game. I think that's just kind of what the game was. Like, we're both kind of playing, like, the removal stuff early. Lots of cards are just tra trading, and whoever had their top end card won. All right, we'll try it again. No, we, we have not had good draws those, those last two games. We did not. All right, same kind of thing. This is another big deck. We need to just get our spells that matter, which are not any of those. We need Aftershock. These jewels are more and this time we have champions. Um, from from playing this deck, though, it definitely feels like we need three Field of Rush. That certainly feels like that card needs to be a three of. Be brave. Freljord doesn't have a landmark removal spell, does it? Like, is there another landmark removal spell we can play besides just Aftershock? The skies darken with their approach. Let me just get this out of here right away. All right, good news is the sharp sight's gone, as far as blocking Ezreal is concerned. The world's a big place. Let's see all of it. See all of it. Dragon blood, Demacian heart. Let the blood boil, half dragon. Come on, another one. This is your end. End them. Man, Siobhan is all about the end. I will be blocking with Avros and Sentry to be able to turn on uh, to get Shivana down to three health to be able to turn on Brittle Steel. I will unite the Freljord. Yeah, no Freljord landmark removal. Ooh, morning tea time has a good one. Frozen ice pick. They say these were from the protector himself. Um. Averosans, stand together. You know, like five mana, destroy a landmark, or like, you know, frostbite two enemies or something. Slow speed, though. You spurn my gift. Seriously, now hush? We gotta do hush now? So I hate these Targon Demacia decks. Hush and Sharp Sight and the Landmark and Single Combat. Just combining those all together is yuck. I guess I gotta kill that thing, because otherwise they play a really in soul next turn. Like that's what they're doing with this daybreak. They just drew two dragons. That's what they want to do. Suffer my fury. Well, they're attacking with those wrong. 
So attack it real strong. Seriously? Just three sharp sights? And a hush, I just can't I can't do anything. The time is right. Strike now. I wanted to save that, I didn't want to use that flash freeze yet. I really wanted to save that. It's not the worst thing for me, I guess. Like, I mean, obviously that's very bad for me, but at least, like, that, that other car was going to be able to heal their Nexus for five. It's not healing their Nexus for five anymore. And they're also not playing Aurelian Soul. So those two things aren't the worst for me. They're out there. I'll spot them. Well, never mind. That's very bad. Wait. Uh, yeah, because I just frostbite this. Okay. Never mind. That's not so bad. Because they don't—they can't play the the three mana card, and the fight spell. I just don't get to use that on my attack turn, right? Like I, I would have liked to attack with that, but I just don't get to use that on my attack turn. One mana off from Field of Rush. Ice runs in our veins. One mana off from Field of Rush. We make that not block. Make that not block. Attack. Make that not block. They get two blockers. Three attackers. Then we get in for additional three. So that'd be three, four, five. Put I them down to four. Stuff, but could you maybe speed things up a little? No, but I have the flash. Okay, so yeah, so this... So if they only have units in hand, if they don't have spells, we can kill them. Um, but then it's a little risky, because I'm using all of my resources right now. Um, Not and ready. We'll start down that path with this card. The time is right. Strike now. So if they don't have a spell, they lose. They do have a spell, though, so I lose. Our time is over. That was the third one of those. They'd already played two sharp sights. They'd already played two of those. They'd already played a hush. I 
can find another Mystic Shot. Can we draw another Mystic Shot? Six. That should actually be able to do it, right? Oh, no, wait. Uh, yeah, because we can... Slow speed. Let's see. Let's first get this damage in. Slow speed, get that... I'll put him to one. They may let it happen because it lets him go to one. And then I'd have the burst. Okay, that should be a win for us. Great progress day. The troll chant is two damage. And it's burst, they can't respond to it. So unless they have hush. Which they probably would have hushed before. You're between me and glory. No backing down. There we go. That was close. I think my opponent would have won that game if they didn't use that star shaping on, you know, that was the, the thing. Like, they used the star shaping to, to, to save their Shyvana, but honestly, at that point of the game, that previous turn, they should have just saved, just, should have just healed their Nexus for five, because that's like the only way I could have won was Ezreal burning them out. All right, so there we go. Winter Ezreal. Man, that was that was really impressive that we still... That Ez, Ezreal still won that game, even with my opponent um, using two sharp sights to block Ezreal and also a hush to block Ezreal. Used all those to block Ezreal, yet that still that same Ezreal stayed alive the whole time and killed my opponent because we got to uh, just protect our Ezreal a bunch once with the Troll Chant, other times with Frostbite cards, keeping the Ezreal alive. It's so very impressive. Um, yeah, very impressive. I liked the the Rhyme Touch Shaman a lot. I really liked that, that card. That card did a ton of work for us. Um, yeah, that Progress Day won us that last game. That's for sure. Getting us the, you know, being a spell for Ezreal, getting us more spells for Ezreal. Uh, that won us that game. Uh, so yeah, I think I think it worked out pretty well. You know, like we, we played against the exact same deck three times in a row. And that's, that's difficult to beat any deck three times in a row. And uh, we won two, lost one. You know, it's like that's going to happen and and everything. And then, like, both of our losses, we really didn't draw well in either loss. You know, like, we didn't have, like, our champions or Feel the Rush or Progress Day or Ryan Tusk Shaman. You know, like, we didn't have, like, any of those cards that, that can help us win the game. We just had some things to slow them down. So there we go. There's there's the Winter Ezreal. Uh, those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Leave those comments. Let me know what you think of the deck. Uh, hopefully, hopefully y'all enjoyed this one because I, th I think it was pretty strong. It looked it looked good. We we defeated uh, some really good decks in there um, and everything. You know, like just switch out switch out just a you know a couple of cards here and the, here or there. Like from what we drew, what our opponent drew could have you know had a better record, but still, like I, I liked it. I think that felt like a very good three and two deck. All right, but anyway, that's it here for for Winter Ezreal. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.